What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Hustle Man back with another video. So, let me run down my thrift store haul for the last week and a half. Uh, let's see. Let me show you what I got. So, these are all the items I bought in the last week or so. Um, I found these uh, North Face insulated pants at a at a good not no nah, I didn't get these at Goodwill. I found these at um I found these at uh Graceful Buys for twelve dollars. These should retail I I can list these for I saw some listed for hundred and seventy dollars. So I think I can sell these for at least a hundred to a hundred and fifteen, hundred and twenty. They're in great shape. Uh well, there is some issues right there on the bottom, but I can probably still get a hundred dollars for these or seventy-five dollars, but it's all good. So here are a pair of motorcycle pants. These are BMW. You see the BMW right there. I paid seven, seven, seven dollars for these. These will retail. I can relist these for up to maybe about a hundred and forty, one fifty. I saw some listed for about 149 or something like that. They went and they were pre-owned like these. So I found this look. New Jack City Nino Brown sweater. Cop that for I think I paid $7 for that at Goodwill. I'm gonna clean it up. Get all the lint off of it. Now, let's run down the shoes real quick. So Let's run down these Adidas. I found these Adidas at a pawn shop. And I paid $30 for those. So I have these listed for $75. So those should, should sell pretty quick. Uh, check out the Nikes. These are awesome kicks. That the heels are in great shape. The soles are in great shape. They look like they were barely worn. I'm going to list those for $100. I paid... How much I pay for those? I think I paid 40 bucks for these. I also found these at a pawn shop. I uh, found these golf. These are foot joys. found these foot joys for... I think I paid nine, $8.99 for these at Goodwill. I'm gonna list these for $65 to $75. They retail for 100 bucks. Found these little nice little Converse's. They're brand new. I paid, it says 24, but I only paid, uh, I think I only paid $18 for those. I'm gonna list those for like 40. And there's another pair I bought at the, at the pawn shop. I paid, uh, $25 for these. These are the uh, Puma running systems. Uh, the RS, RSO running system. They, they're brand new pretty much. So I'm going to list those for $75. And these bad boys, these vans, I bought those at Goodwill. I paid. Do, 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 I want to say I paid $14 for those. I'm going to list these for 45 to 50. They brand new. Still got the box with them. So let's run down these men's garments that I purchased at Graceful Buys. Check this out. That's a genuine full sun garment. These these shirts go for man. I seen some listed for like 75 to 95 bucks. And they, this is uh, like excellent. Like these are great. These are great um, shirts. That's a great brand right there. So I think it's a, it's a vintage brand, but they're quality, well made. I think I paid seven, eight dollars for this shirt. I'm gonna list it for like 50 to 60 bucks. Here's one of the highlights of the, of the, uh, of the whole shopping experience. I found this Patagonia. It has a, uh, FDL energy on it. Uh, is that energy? I guess, yeah, that's energy. 
but I paid twelve dollars for this Patagonia. I'ma list it and sell it for sixty bucks. Yeah, that's a great vintage. It has pockets on the inside, zippers. It's in great shape. I think someone would love that. Okay, there's some golf shirts I picked up. Check that out. These are, I think, Grayson's. Yeah, Grayson's golf shirts. These are like um, high-end golf shirts. Uh, this is, I think, a XL. Yeah, this is a XL. Paid eight dollars for these. I'ma list these for forty to fifty dollars. So I found, I found three, three of those. So check it out. Here's the white one. That's a Grayson also. Grayson is a great brand. Found this one. Another one. Check it out. Yeah. That's another one. I'm going to list those for 40 to 50. And here's another one. Another Grayson. This one has a stain on it. I don't know if you can see it, but I'm going to get a stain removal in get that stain out but yeah I'm gonna I'm a list that one for probably 40 50 dollars and this is this one is not a Grayson this one is let me see what's the, what's the tag on this one is a Peter Miller Peter, Peter Miller Miller and this one was 10.99 it's an XL and it has the master logo on it. So, you know I'm going to ask for top dollar for that one. That's going to be a good deal. I hadn't even listed these yet, as a matter of fact. And I'm going to show y'all what I picked up at a good at a thrift store in, Dow in, in Dallas. Found these Cartier. These Cartier Aviators. Found those at a Goodwill. Now, I took them to the pawn shop. To see if they were real to make sure they were real and the guy said they are real sorry about that guy i got i got really inter interrupted by my camera uh, but my memory card was full so all right getting back to this so i took these to the pawn shop i took them to the first pawn shop the guy said they weren't real because he didn't even know what to look for so I took him to another pawn shop and he said, yeah, these are real. Cause he looked at the, uh, I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a watermark inside the low, inside the lens right there in the corner. I don't know if you can see it cause of the shadow. But yeah, anyway, he offered me 350 for these, but I paid 60 bucks for them, but I didn't take it. So. I might list them myself for like 500 bucks or 450 but I might ask him to take it would he take 400 and I might sell it to him so this is what I did it didn't come with a box they were out of the box but I went online on eBay and just bought a box for it you know just so it to make it you know legit or whatever but I mean you know hey I mean it is what it is it might it might not be the real Cartier box but it says Cartier on it, but they're, the glasses are real. But it came with glass cleaner and this little, this little thing to keep them, keep them safe. But anyway, guys, man, thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for subscribing to the channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. And until the next video, I'll see y'all later. Peace. in his life going to the goodwill find something i like on the hunt for some cool and unique finds got it on the low but i can double the price uh, it's the thrill it's the rush i do it for the high i do it for the love i do it for the funds i do it because it is fun can't knock the hustle i'm the one listen i'm on a mission flipping products for profit with a keen eye for what pops on the market uh, when I make my choices, I just work my plan. You're now rocking with, rocking with the hustle man.